hi on this video i will show how to build the docker images using the gitlab ca cd let's do it from scratch if you don't know the basic structure of this gitlab file you can refer to my first video i'm going to create a simple docker file I'm going to use open to latest version. Next, I'm going to specify the working directory. Directory. Then I'm going to run some commands to get update. I'm going to run a command to get the Python version. Then minus v. That's all. Let's add this docker file to this GitLab file. First, we have to specify the stages. Stages. Yeah, I'm only using one stage. I'm giving it a name, Docker. Next, I have to specify the service that I am using. Services Docker. Then I'm going to create a new job called Docker job. First, I have to specify the in stage. This Docker. This then. I have to specify the image. Image. Docker. Then I have to add the scripts. Docker. For building this Docker file, I am using the script Docker. Build. Dot command. Let's see if it's working. Let's commit this code. Let's see the pipeline. Mm, there is some problem in YAML file. Mm, the script. There is some problem with the script. Let's see what the problem is. I think it's only script. Let's see. That's running. Let's see. Python not found that means in this Ubuntu version the Python is not pre-installed so that's the problem let's clear that let's add the script to install this Python we can do it along with the update command apt get install Python minus minus portion okay let's commit this
okay the command is executing docker build dot okay that's installing python okay the python version now let's add this image to the container registry provided by the GitLab. For that, we need to add some commands in the script here. On the first step, we have to use the docker login command. Docker login minus u for the username. For that, we can use the GitLab variables, environmental variables can google it for that GitLab. Mm, predefined variables get the ci register user password from this variable so let's add minus u for the user dollar symbol then environmental variable name then minus p for password password dollar then ci registry Next step, we have to add this command, replace this command, then after building we have to push that image, so we can use this command, that's all, let's add this code. login succeeded okay now it's building now it's pushing this image that's done we can see this image here on this container registry part this one latest tag this one is our image 